let's learn about a cylinder okay what is a cylinder cylinder is the surface generated by locus of straight lines which are parallel to a fixed straight line and intersect a curve or touch a surface okay a cone was the surface generated by locus of straight lines which were intersecting a fixed point cylinder is locus of straight lines which are parallel to fixed straight line okay and the other condition is that it must intersect a curve or touch a surface okay so let's see what a cylinder is so let's suppose i have a curve okay then it is the locus of straight lines which are parallel to a fixed straight line okay let's suppose i have a fixed straight line in a plane which is different from this curve then the locus of straight lines which are parallel to this would be like this these straight lines they intersect this curve okay so this is essentially a cylinder okay as you can see this surface that i have got is a cylindrical surface okay your cylinder does not necessarily have to be like this okay it depends on the curve on the basis of which you are drawing the cylinder okay so the convention is same this curve is known as the guiding curve and these straight lines are known as the generators okay let's find out the equation of a cylinder whose guiding curve is quadratic in x and y and whose fixed line has direction cosines l m and n okay so the guiding curve is essentially a conic given by this equation in x y plane which is z is equal to 0 and the fixed line is having direction cosines l m and n okay i know my cylinder is locus of lines which are parallel to this fixed line okay so let's just suppose that i have x1 y1 z1 as a point that lies on cylinder okay it's just a arbitrary point that i am assuming lies on this cylinder so i know a point i know my lines are parallel to this therefore my lines are going to be having equation x minus x1 upon l equal to y minus y1 upon m equal to z minus z1 upon n okay now a point x on such a line is let's say this is equal to k then my point x on such a line is going to be lk plus x1 y is going to be mk plus y1 and z is going to be nk plus z1 now i must have points which are common between this guy which is the curve and also this plane okay since my lines intersect this curve which is in this plane i must have points which are common between the line between the curve and between the plane therefore z is equal to 0 must be satisfied by this point okay so what i have is nk plus z1 equal to 0 which tells me that k is equal to minus z1 upon n okay and my x is therefore going to be l into k which is minus l into z1 by n plus x1 and my y is going to be m into k which is m into this guy which is m into or rather minus m into z1 upon n plus y1 okay now we've already seen that we have point common between the line between the curve and this so my x and y also should be satisfying the